welcome back to my channel. I want to talk to you today a little bit about mohair or kid silk. And I've recently gotten into this yarn. And uh, that is because I was looking at some patterns on Ravelry and I found one um, called Cecilia. And I couldn't find the pattern to download anywhere. There were quite a few um, projects on Ravelry with that um, nice top, but I couldn't find the pattern to download until I realized that was because it's in a book. So I had to order the book. And uh, this is it. The book is uh, by Lene Holm Samso. I, I hope that I say the name right. And it's called Essentially Feminine Knits. And it's got 25 um, different patterns. And you can see some of them in here. But this is the one I'm talking about. This is Cecilia, it's my all time favorite. I love it so much. And um, I have to say, it's so easy to knit. And um, I think I would have much more fun to knit it in just like a fingering weight yarn instead of these, this mohair silky thing because this is a pain to work with. It's a pain to work with, but it looks so nice. So, so nice. And um, I did adjust the pattern a little bit uh, for myself because I didn't want to make it as like a kimono thing type of thing and I'll show you here just a little bit what it looks like so far. But as you can see, I mean it's gorgeous. It's so nice and the, the, this heart shape um, like yarn overs is just so nice. I love it. But I, um, I, I, can't, I can't give you a pattern. I'm going to link to the book. I bought it on Amazon. It wasn't expensive for 25 different patterns, which are all amazing. They're all so nice. Look, look at that. They're all so nice. And there are quite a few garments. They're quite... Let me just show you the pictures. Um, sorry, it's copyright. I, I can't... <laughs> I can't show you any patterns. I'll just show you what the garments look like. But look at that. Look at that. That's just so nice. That's a cardigan. Let's see what else we can find that I can show you. They have a coat. They have a scarf, shawls, um, wrap cardigans this I love so much look at that that is so nice I love the the leaves it's an amazing book and it's so worth every every cent every pence <laughs> let me just go to the one I'm knitting right now and show you the picture in the book here it is now, isn't that just gorgeous? It's just beautiful. I love it. Um, but yeah, the, the things that are just a few things that I wanted to mention uh, with, with the mohair yarn is that you have to use these markers that are like, they don't have any gaps. Otherwise, they stick. They, your yarn gets um, stuck in it so these are the only ones that I could use I couldn't use any of the ones I make um, the stitch holders yeah they work all right these ones but I got confused so many times because of the yarn not because of the pattern the pattern is amazingly um, written but yeah this is what it looks like uh, when I finish it, I will insert pictures of it. But um, yeah, I just wanted to tell you about this amazing book. And I, I like this. This drops kid silk. It's, it's very, 
I mean, it's not, I mean, it's not a pound chip, cheap, but it's cheaper than a lot of others. Rowan, they do one, which is a bit more expensive. It's very soft and very squishy. I don't know if it's going to be itchy, but obviously because it's, it's quite transparent, you would have to wear it with a tank top, top underneath. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I divided my sleeves on row 58 of the pattern um, because I wanted to make it, I wanted to have sleeves and, and a body like a, like a normal t-shirt kind of style. But this is just gorgeous. Yeah, anyway, this was just a tiny, tiny um, video to tell you about my experience with mohair. I will definitely try to make something else with this type of yarn. It's more like a summery knit, I guess. But I like it. I mean, it, it looks so nice. It looks so chic. <laughs> yeah. Let me know what you think about mohair and if you want to order the book, I will link it down below. And also, I will link... Uh, her Instagram because she's been doing I think she's got a new book out uh, for babies so she does a lot of baby knitting patterns which are amazing and her Instagram is just you know to to scroll you can't stop scrolling down her Instagram account is beautiful yeah well um, that is it I've done a lot of filming today so hopefully I can edit the videos and I will see you I will see you soon have a nice week. Bye.